Hey guys, what's up? It's Matchpoint here, and today we're going to be taking a look at an updated guide on how to play Lion in Rainbow Six Siege. As you can see, he is a two armor and two speed operator. His loadout has a V308 assault rifle, the 417 marksman rifle, and an SG shotgun. I'd recommend taking the V308. You should run an ACOG, a compensator, an underbarrel, and a vertical grip. As you can see, he has 50 bullets in one magazine, which is just incredible to think about, and not many operators have this, which is why it's a great idea to pick Lion. For his secondaries, he has a P9 or a revolver. Personal preference on this one. He has a Claymore and a stun grenade. Personally, I'd take the Claymore, and I'd recommend you to do so as well. Now let's get into Lion's gadget. Lion's gadget is a drone that will scan for enemy movement, and if um, the enemy moves within that time period of the scan going off, they will get trapped, kind of like an alibi gadget. And as you can see, we pick up that kill on the cap cam there. And we're going to use another drone scan. And you do actually get three of these, which is uh, quite a lot considering how powerful these are. I recommend using the gadget, especially when teammates are pushing in, for example. Um, maybe if you're communicating with your team and they're in a bit of trouble, you can use uh, your gadget to get some more intel on. And even if you're not communicating, you can just use it when you see people pushing on in. And I'd also recommend using it when you yourself are going to be pushing in as well. Now we're going to be pushing in through here and the Maverick's going to use his gadget to get through. And we're going to be using our gadget also and it's a great idea to do that considering our teammate is pushing in so we can gain that extra bit of intel and I recommend you guys to do that as well. So we're going to be coming down these stairs here and we're going to be using our gadget. We do in fact get a tag and we go to pre-fire him and we secure the kill on him. And that just shows how powerful his gadget can be. And again in this clip here we're going to be coming down these stairs. The objective's right in there, so we're just going to make sure to use our gadget. And we in fact do catch someone off guard because they um, try not to get tagged by our gadget and they stand still and we secure the kill on them. So again here we're going to be repelling up and we just used our gadget and look how many tags we get. And that may not reveal much information to us because we're not near them, but for our teammate it opens up a whole new world. Now again we're going to be coming in through here, so we're going to make sure to use our gadget and we're going to be pushing through onto these stairs right here. So if you're going to be rushing in, you want to be make sure you're using your gadget locks and frequently so you get a lot of intel on where they are. Like there, we secure the kill on that dock. And again we're going to push in here and secure the objective. And now in this clip you're going to be seeing how powerful Lion's gun is, especially with his gadget as well. Now it is a 4v2, 4v4 situation, sorry, and we've just gone and killed the pulse, and that makes it a 3v3, and we pick up another kill there, which turns it into a 3v2, and again you saw how we could pick up those two kills dead quickly, and we've just gone and used the gadget right there again to gain some more information for us and our teammates. And right now it's a 2v2, and my guess is that there's going to be someone else in here, as we've already caught two of them in, and there is, the Valkyrie will pick up the kill on her. Now again in here, this is kind of going to sum up how good Lion can be, how useful he is, and what great asset he can be on your team. As you see here, a guy came outside from this room, so we know he's probably going to be in here, we catch a glimpse of him there. So we're just going to be pre-firing around the corner as we've got 50 bullets in one magazine, which is a great reason to pick Lion. And my guess is he's going to be rotating round here. So we're going to use our gadget again to see if we can scan him. And we do in fact scan him. You see that there. So we're going to break this window. We're going to try and pre-fire him. But we don't see him. And we're going to hold this angle down here to see if he pops up. But it's looking like he's not going to show his face especially after we've used that gadget on him and we've still got one more left. 
Now they are playing very aggressive, most of them hopping outside, moving around, which is going to be great for us as we've got a gadget that detects movement. As you see there, another one hopping out. I don't know why they're being so aggressive, but it's good for us. And now we pick up the kill there on the alibi. And we're going to be pushing in here and we pick up the cap can. We didn't even know he was there. We catch him off guard. And look at how good Lion's gun is. And we secure the kill on him. Now in this clip here, we're going to be taking a look at Lion's role. And what he should, what he should be doing if you pick Lion. So ideally you want to be surviving for most of the round. As you've got three of these um, drone scans. And they ha do have quite a long cooldown on them. Not too long though. So ideally you want to be staying alive and you want to be making sure you're using them. And Finker is a great addition to the team as well as Lion. As you can rush in and use your gadget to get more intel whilst you're rushing. As you saw in the clip previously. And we've just had two detectors on there. And we do pick up the kill on that dock there. And we did catch him off guard by standing still. And that was all because of that gadget. And I am thinking to myself, there's probably one more in there. As I remember seeing a Jaeger in there. So I'm just going to point it out to my teammates. But I do hear someone behind me. And we flick on that bandit. And we take him down. And I'm just going to be pre-firing through this wall. Considering we've got 50 bullets in a magazine. We're fine to do that. And I'm trying to get any shots off I can on them. And remember when we used our gadget before. We did in fact detect them down there. So guys, that is going to be it for today's video. I hope you have all enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye bye.